hi guys welcome back to the channel it's your girl still again so today i'm reviewing a new product i got no i got it two months ago which i'm pretty like cosmetic please if it's something you like to watch please do keep on watching and if you haven't hit the subscribe button please do hit the subscribe button give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if i'm not yet done that with that ado let's go straight into so, the background of the story i saw this new foundation on Instagram, which I'm with Ageless Cosmetics. I was like, hmm, what foundation is this? And it was blending real girl. I was like, wow. So I came down to YouTube to search and check out the reviews of this foundation, and I saw nothing. Just the post that the company have made on YouTube. So I just got it blindly and started using it. So I've used it like for I've used it like a couple of times. Let me keep my um, my judgment that you guys will see as we go. So it came in a pack like this. I ordered like I ordered one, two, three. I ordered three shades plus the I think four shades plus the primer. That's what I got. So and they wrapped it like this and sent it. It's even there. Which I'm sure is cosmetic. So did I say I got three shades? I lied. I got four. I got the darkest shade. This is the Mocha. I got chestnut. I got honey. And I got. Wow, oh, what's that? What, what shade is this? Ageless. Oh, the shade name is Ageless. I got Ageless. This, but this is how it comes in a pack wrapped. Hello. In a bottle like this, a cover. You can pump it out. This is how it feels. So I'm going in with the first shade, which is ageless. Let me swipe it and let you guys see. This is the lightest shade. Okay, let me read what they wrote on their Instagram before we continue. See, product you which I'm ageless sweat free matte foundation available in eight different shades. 407 is the lightest shade, which is what I just swapped, and 808 is the darkest shade. I'll show you guys later. That's just the description of it. I don't like that bit. I have honey, which is the second lightest shade. Let me swipe, swipe it out for you guys. The packaging is quite nice. Don't fall from that one. Second lightest shade, which is honey. Next shade is supposed to be cinnamon. I didn't get that one. After cinnamon, it's caramel, which is 600. I didn't get that one. Then chestnuts, which is what I'm about to swap now. See the one I thought was supposed to be my skin shade. That's why I got that one. I didn't get ebony, I didn't get bronze, but I got mo mocha. This is the darkest shade in this collection. That's the darkest. It's darker than flawless, the darkest shade in flawless eye foundation. Which is ebony. This one is quite dark. So I was thinking this one is going to be my shade. So we use this one. I was close enough. So I've moisturized my face and all, and I got their primer. The Sistee Matte Sweat Free Face Primer Moisturizer. This is not a matte primer. It is not matte at all. 
it feels soft in the eyes and in the hands. It smells like one of these mentors. It's really not that bad. And it applies like a moisturizer too. Like your baby cream feels like that. Those are all those baby creams. Feels oily in the face. Like as if you're rubbing oil in the face. And it doesn't dry up. So I'll wait for some time for it to dry up. Two pumps. See this foundation it feels like there's nothing inside. Very light. See? It feels like there's nothing inside. And I got it for I got it for three thousand five hundred naira. Application seamless, it blends really well. That two pound was too much. I don't like using too much foundation. So let me go up time to blend, blend, blend. So this is it after blending for how long? Did it blend really nicely? Not full coverage. But it can be built up. I don't like too much foundation on my face. Let me now with my concealer, my regular concealer. Going in with the contour, the flawless foundation as my contour. today for the blush because this foundation feels like it has sucked all the color out of my face and literally has sucked all the colors I have to add color on my face Using my flawless to set all the highlighter part of my face since I'm done with all the liquid. I always go in with the liquid first. When I'm done, then I start with the powders. And I don't click, I just press it in. So I'm doing like dry makeup using this one to set my face. So we will contour my face. Setting the rest of my face. Using this pink shadow to set my blush since I use powder. 
So the moment we have all been meeting has come. Sorry, I did my I went and did my eyes and lashes off cam. So the verdict on the ageless cosmetics, the charm ageless cosmetics, the foundation, ageless kind of lighter shade, really ashy. It did it do, it did blend well, but it's ashy. Coverage none. You build and build. No coverage. It's actually no coverage. Even this chestnut ashy too. No wonder tone. The only if okay if you are really dark, I think you should go for beach and because that their darker shade is everything white. The darker shade blends well. The undertone is really good. Dark, I use it on my hands because I did my hand makeup. It was it was it. It was perfect, better than flawless. Flawless, the darker shade is here born and it wasn't really dark. But this one, the darker shade was really dark and it won't have well. But other ones, like this chestnut, no one that one. Ageless, no one that one. That's the three I've used. I've not used honey. But I try using honey to, to do um, conceal, no one that one. So I don't know why. You know when everybody have on that one this foundation no on that one i have been doing makeup i have not seen me using it so it's one of my least so only the dark is mocha if they are dark this is how i can use the charm you guys hope you've learned something from all this my rambling so please don't forget to subscribe give your girl a big thumbs up like the video share your thoughts on the comment section if you have improved the formula of this foundation now since i got it when it was launched so if you have improved the foundation now or if it is still as ashy as this if you have used classic before you remember that classic we were using before right <laughs> this is how this bitch am is feeling like this is how it feels like your face is ashy after using it no one that one this is like classic those days classic classic is even good now but those days that time were really small those classic that time that you were looking up already this is how this one is so until the next video guys bye